Hey everyone, welcome to the fourth buyer tip. Uh, this one's going to be based around what to be wary of. So by now you've probably been looking around for a little while. Uh, the best thing to sort of keep in mind is buy the worst house in the best street. It's an old-fashioned saying that's been thrown around for years and years and years. Um, and that's based around what you can actually do to the house. So if it's in the best street and it needs a little bit of work, obviously you're going to make money off that at some stage, depending on the market obviously. If you went and bought the best house in the street that's probably not as good, you're probably not going to make as much as what you would, would like to eventually down the track if you're going to sell. So be wary of your areas. What I'd suggest is going for a walk after hours, going for a drive after hours, getting a feel for the neighbourhood when you get your criteria cut down. So say your top three houses, let's go for a drive after hours. Go for a drive in the, in the school zones or the school times. Um, the work times, 9 o'clock in the morning when people are going to work. Do things like that just to get a feel for what traffic's like and what the neighbourhood's like. That'll keep you in the right stead, obviously put you in the right direction. We'll see you next time for the next buy tip.